A top story that we are tracking at this hour is about a Russian military plane that crashed into the sea of Ukraine's annexed Crimean Peninsula. The Su-27 fighter jet was consumed by flames as it spiraled through the air towards the Black Sea. Now, the aircraft eventually smashed into the sea of the annexed Sevastopol in Crimea, but not before the pilot managed to escape within an inch of his life. The Russian installed governor of Crimea said that the pilot ejected and was picked up by rescuers but gave no detail about the cause of the crash. Meanwhile, Maria Abdiva, a Ukrainian security expert, claimed that it had been shot down, while other pro-Ukraine telegram channels speculated that the cause was a friendly fire. Meanwhile, Kyiv's military said that Ukrainian forces shot down 26 out of 28 attack drones launched overnight by Russia. The Air Force added that the Iranian-made drones were destroyed over parts of eastern, southern and southeastern Ukraine. Prosecutors in the eastern Kharkiv region said a restaurant, a store and offices were damaged by the debris from three drones. Now, while the Air Force added that Russia's overnight attack included several types of missiles, the Odessa region governor, Ole Kippa, said Russia carried out a separate missile strike later. However, no injuries were reported. Russia has launched regular airstrikes on population centers far behind the lines of its two-year-old full-scale invasion of Ukraine. Moscow, on the other hand, claims to have destroyed Ukrainian tanks, including one U.S.-made tank, along with various equipment and facilities. The Russian Ministry of Defense said that in the past day, their air defense forces destroyed 131 Ukrainian drones and shot down multiple rockets. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.